Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel Learn Math with Mr. Saad for another video lesson. Today's lesson for grade 4, chapter 9, lesson 6, add mixed numbers. Page number is 593. Okay, first of all, you guys have to understand what are mixed numbers. Whenever we write a number, a whole number, and a fraction together, we call it mixed number like it is two whole and a fraction one over two whenever we write it together we call it mixed numbers so today we are going to add mixed numbers so to add mixed numbers first of all what we do guys we add the whole numbers like this is three whole one over four plus two whole one over four so first of all we add the whole numbers whole numbers three here and two here three plus two equals five and then we add the fractions 1 over 4 plus 1 over 4 is equal to 2 over 4 you know that we only add the numerators when we are adding the fractions and the denominator stays same now you can see that this fraction 2 over 4 we can simplify it divide by 2 up divide by 2 down it will be 5 whole 1 over 2 here they are writing it in terms of unit fractions uh, this one is already unit fraction Unit fractions means any fraction that have 1 in its numerator. And 3, they break it into 1, 1, 1, and this 2, 1, 1, like that. No need to do this. We can directly add it like this and then simplify it. Okay, example 2. Here, first we add the whole numbers. The whole numbers are 1 and 2. 1 plus 2 is 3. And then we will add the fractions 1 over 3 plus 1 over 3 is equal to 2 over 3. So 3 whole 2 over 3. Here it is 3 whole 2 over 3. Okay what they are doing here guys they convert this one into improper fraction. This is another way of adding the mixed numbers. You can use this way also but this one is easier which I told you first. They convert this mixed number into improper fraction. To convert a mixed number into improper fraction, we took this lesson before, guys. We can multiply the whole number with the denominator and then add the numerator. 1 times 3 is equal to 3 and plus 1, 4. So it will become 4 over 3. The denominator stays same. 2 times 3 equals 6 plus 1, 7. 7 over 3. Now they add it. 4 over 3 plus 7 over 3 equals 11 over 3. Now it is an improper fraction, so we convert it into a mixed number. How many groups of 3 we can take out of 11? 3. If we take out 3 groups of 3 from 11, which means 9, so what left behind 11 minus 9? The remainder is 2 over 3. So you can do it in this way or the one which I told you in the start directly. Just Add the whole numbers and then add the numerators and denominators stay the same. Okay, here uh, 2 plus 2, 4 and 3 plus 1, 4 over 6. And then we simplify it, divide by 2 up, divide by 2 down. So it will be 4 whole 2 over 3. Similarly, guys, you will solve all these examples in independent practice and then match your answers through this video okay here you have to choose which one is correct according to this and which one is wrong Baron ate two whole one over four apples then he ate another one whole two over four apples so what is the total you add both of them two whole one over four plus one whole two over four three whole three over four here uh, the bakery shop purchased seven whole two over ten pounds of sugar and seven whole five or ten pounds of flour so you add them seven plus seven fourteen and two plus seven seven over ten we cannot simplify it is already simplest form so fourteen whole seven over ten pounds uh, here, Mrs. Argo has three whole 7 over 12 boxes of pens. She has four whole 1 over 12 boxes of pencils and two boxes of markers. So you add all of them, three whole 7 over 12 plus four whole 1 over 12 plus two. 
So first you add the whole numbers, 3 plus 4 plus 2 equals 9, and then you add the fractions, 7 over 12 plus 1 over 12 equals 8 over 12, and then we simplify it. 9 whole, 2 over 3. And these questions down here. Write a real world problem, you can write by yourself. I will see the students work. Okay and some definitions here thank you so much guys i hope you really understand the lesson if you really understand don't forget to like this video and subscribe my channel learn math with mr sad for more lessons thank you so much guys have a nice day